What's up guys, today I'm going to show you how to create a timer in UDD5. So to get started, I'm going to create a C-sharp script first, it's known as the timer. So after the timer has been imported successfully to my project, I assign it to the main camera. So to assign, I drag and drop it to my main camera game object. Okay, now I'm going to open timer script to edit it in monodevelop. After monodevelop has been successfully launched, I'm going to create some variables. The interval of the timer. The interval is the, the time period that the timer does nothing, actually, it is counted. Loop. Loop is a rule actually states that the timer loops or not. Right here, you can specify the task that you want to do and the looping. You may be wondering why I use this private flow timer variable. That's because uh, when the loop is called, I can actually, I can't actually get the basic value which is the interval. Uh, if interval is changed how can i get the original value so that's the basic and here i specify the task uh, actually i call it do and i'm gonna do this task okay let's lock it timer called Now it's okay. After pressing play, you can see how it works. And as you can see, I never set this into a value. That's why it's going that much longer. So I'm going to set it to one second. Uh, one second should be good. Now as you can see, for every second it is calling the timer, debug the log function, actually the do function right here, and you can modify it. And this is how to do that, how to create a timer in Unity. So you can use this concept to almost everything in your games actually I use this concept to actually almost everything is here uh, if you want new videos like this please subscribe to my youtube channel and thanks for watching and 
I hope you use this for some kind of a great thing. And see you guys in the next video.